Guys, I'll teach you how to become a programmer in less than 10 minutes. Let's get right into it. So the first thing that you want to do is basically Google Visual Studio Code. Let's get right into it. This is a code editor. If you guys have ever written like uh, any... Uh, this is it. This is literally it, guys. This is it. This is the ebook that I've been working on. It's called FreeJS Essentials, a beginner's guide, part one. This is part one of the ebook. You can definitely... Like any pages or done any homework, you've probably been using Word, a word editor, just to like uh, rearrange text and write text and, and uh, edit text. Co this code editor is basically to edit your program, also basically edit your your code. So and it's uh, very interactive and it's very intelligent. So that is why we use a code editor. Basically, just download it and there you go. Download it, get started, whatever, whatever, whatever. And then you also want to download Node node.js you're going to need this for for coding in javascript so please go ahead and download this just download the the long term uh, the long term support so you don't encounter encounter any bugs so after after downloading uh, visual studio code you want to install it basically go to the download tab and uh, then you want to open and after that then you want to open visual studio code the first thing that you want to do, let's become a programmer in less than 10 minutes. Right click, just open a folder and then right click on this, on this explorer, uh, on this explorer section. And then click on new file, call it index.html. This will be your very first code. And basically do this. And then type in enter. And what you want to do is download an extension called live server. So type in live server. And basically click on it and then install it. I've already installed it, so let's get back. So it, uh, two minutes have passed. Let's get back and cl double click on this. Just pin it for uh, just in case it, it, it goes missing. Now this is basically your HTML file. Guys, every single web page that you ever encounter on the web is basically a HTML file. What you see right here is an HTML file. What you see right here is also a, an a HTML an HTML file with a header, uh, some t some paragraphs and text, a title, and two buttons. And then you have uh, links that are clickable. So let's get back into Visual Studio Code. Every, like, you just, you have to understand, every single web page, even youtube.com, even google.com, even github.com, they are all basically just uh, web page files. I mean, HTML files that you ask the server to get for you and it basically displays it on your computer and that is how the the internet works i just explained the whole internet for you so we will create our own little uh, internet file you can call it that that is called html so in the body let's create oh uh, sorry you want to click you want to click the go live so right click on this and then click on open with live server and it should open up something right over here Perfect. Oh. And as you can see, it basically open, opened everything up over here and over there. I'll just minimize the screen so you guys can also see uh, something. Perfect. Now we have a blank page. Let's just inspect this. Let's inspect this blank page. And as you can see, we don't really have anything um, other than this. Uh, let's go. All right, so we basically have the head, the body, and and the script. If we want to add any like uh, JavaScript, but for for this video, we just want to create a simple HTML and CSS uh, program. So web uh, website. So let's get right into it in the body. Just type in. These are HTML elements, guys. You guys have to understand. These are also HTML elements. The body, the body element tag, uh, HTML tags. They're called and in the head you basically uh, incorporate and implement stuff like anything that has to do with CEO and for the title you can basically switch this to uh, my own website and please focus on this on this part right over here my own website and if I click on control it we are running on the on the live server then it will basically change it on the on the web page itself now let's create our first title. So we will do this with a H1, with a H1 title, uh, HTML tag, H1, there we go. And let's write my 
my first H first HTML H1. That is all. Basic guys, you ba you guys basically created your own website. Congratulations! But let's add some fancy stuff. Um, let's say that we want to. Hmm, let's say that we also want to add a paragraph. So we want to add some uh, boring text. Blah blah blah. There you go. And then we also want to add a button. So that's basically it. Uh, you then you wanna then you wanna create a HTML element called button and finish it off. And then type something like click here. Perfect. And guys, that is basically it. You can also style this. So you can basically get a uh, link. So guys, up in this header, let's just organize this. In Visual Studio Code, you can basically say uh, format document and it basically makes everything very pretty. Um, then we want to link our CSS file, so we will also have to create that. You, you guys can just type in link CSS, you have to be in this header to do this. Link CSS, and it will basically say um, we are using the style sheet, and it's going to refer to this style.css. But we don't really have a CSS file for now, so let's just create it over here in the explorer section. Let's call it style.css. And let's say that we want to change uh, the background color. So, so, so to change the background color for the whole body, you will basically type in dot and then do something like this and type in background color equals equals uh, black or something or white. So that's basically it guys, you guys basically created this whole thing. title. So anytime you give a HTML element a, a, an ID, you have to tag it with the hashtag in the CSS file. So let's do a hashtag, what did we call it? We call it a title. So let's go down below and change it to color red. Sorry, color red. And there you go, that's basically CSS guys. Thank you guys for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel, like this video and comment down below. See you on the next one. We basically created our own website in less than 10 minutes. Thank you guys for watching.